All right. Uh, today we're going to go over uh, a little bit more on foam rolling with the foam roller along the same direction as our spine and the importance of the ability to activate the core and stabilize the spine and not have our spine start to bow when we are stretching and doing the floor um, angel on the foam roller. And so we're going to focus in a little bit tighter into my stomach. So that hopefully this comes across because this is an important um, little fine nuance. So I'm going to exaggerate it. So if I come to stretch and I'm doing floor angel and my back is arching because I have excessive tightness in my shoulders, this is not going to uh, help stretch the shoulders. It's just going to put added stress on my uh, lower back and my thoracic spine. So we're gonna start with our breath in. So we're gonna breathe in with our big belly breath. And we're gonna blow it out. Hold it, turn the stomach on so the stomach is nice and tight. And then, now my back is not gonna arch. Now I'm gonna focus more of the stretch through the shoulders and the, and the chest and not stretch the spine. So I'm gonna turn off my abs now, my back arches, and then now we're putting more strain on the lumbar spine and the thoracic spine. So one more time, breathe in. We're gonna blow it out. Activate, stomach is tight, pelvis and diaphragm are parallel, and then here we go. We're going nice and tight, boom. Squeezing the shoulder blades together, and just making everything just nice and tight, stretching the shoulders, stretching the pecs, stomach is tight. And that's it. That's the correct way.